Welcome back everyone. I'll go and show you exactly how to enable developer mode on your Oculus Quest 2. Now to do this, it is a little bit of a tedious process, not really, but you will have to have a developer account on your Oculus Quest account. So you want to register as a developer. I'll leave a link in the description. That'll be the first thing that you want to go ahead and do it for. And it's going to tell you to enter the name of your organization. It's going to tell you to sign in all that stuff. And once you log in with your account, you are pretty much good to go. So, and you can always change this specific data a little bit later down the road, but as long as you have a registered developer account, you will be able to be good. And you can also develop and publish apps to the Oculus Store if you want to. Now, once you're ready, you want to come back into your Oculus app that's on your Android or iOS device. And here you want to go ahead and find the specific Quest device that you're trying to utilize, that you're trying to, you know, use for the most part. And here you want to go ahead and open up the settings that's in the bottom right corner. You want to select the Quest device that you're, you know, you're wanting to connect to. You want to click more settings. You want to click developer mode and you want to click on that little switch to have it on and then it's going to tell you to reboot your request then it's going to tell you to reboot your quest so at that point that's all you want to do you want to reboot your quest device turn it off turn it back on and then you're almost ready to go once your quest actually reboots you should see that if you make your way over to your settings and you click on developer you should see the little developer mode actually enabled and you can actually confirm this by actually going through in the quest settings menu and you should be able to see that you have that developer toggle now there and you should be able to see that is on so here if you want to side load or do any side quest things on your oculus quest you should have the ability of doing so or if you wanted to go ahead and utilize anything else within your quest and publish apps well, you have that capability now too. So that's pretty much it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.